Alright, so I played some Dishonored, you know, earlier today, so I thought, okay, after I'm done playing this mission, those missions are pretty long, so after I was done playing this mission, I thought I would just, you know, hop on DBD and play some quick games with DBD, you know, like 2 Survivor, 2 Killer, but no, I'm playing my quick killer game, and like, what do I see in my lobby? It's like four people with like three beamers and a lunchbox. I'm like, what is going on here? So of course I had to throw on my Frankies. So now I'm going up against a bully squad, perhaps. I don't even know, but that's what I named the stream. So let's see what happens. I could be up against a bully squad, but I named the stream Bully Beater, and I don't even think who uh, if I'm gonna get uh, if I'm gonna beat these guys, I might get beaten by the bullies. So I might be the victim of these bullies. I don't know. But here we are, you know, at the asylum. So let's go ahead and see how this goes, you know what I'm saying? Oh, and I would start, like, in a corner. Oh, no, I'm kind of in the middle. It's not too half bad of a spot. Let's go ahead and knock at the door. There's one all the way over there, and someone over there. You went this way? Hello, sir. Yeah! No. Nope. Leave me alone. How is this not hitting him at all? This is not hitting him at all. If only I had the notophobia. Let's go ahead and waste their time getting him since I wasted my time playing with him. Let's go ahead and hook him. Why not? Wow, they already got a gin done. Where's basement? There's basement. So the trial is, uh, challenge is to get people in basement. So, I've already lost a gin. Ah! Because I am being, uh, this is a bully squad. He was the one with the lunchbox, so that means these other three have flashlights. And look at all the explosions, baby. One around. Let's, let's just see where they are. There's somebody over there. <laughs> I need to get some hooks in the basement. I'm not going to catch up before they get to me. But there's somebody else here, too. Let's get this Claudette's beamer. Whoa! How did I miss it? What the hell is going on? There we go, get her beamer. That's what we want to do. Now she just realized she doesn't have her beamer. Ah! I don't want to go up there. But she's running away from the basement. Somebody's over here working. What the hell? Still got her, very nice. So, they just picked up the ace who doesn't want to play. I don't know if this is some type of new tactic that I'm unaware of. Oh, everybody's over here. Still got him, very nice, but he did get the blind. Where's our boy at? More on him, very nice. Just yeeted him right off of there. So I don't think I'm going to be able to get him in the basement. Because I did take off Iron Grasp for Frankie's because I'm up against like three beamers and a A kit. So we need to get him close to the basement. They were working on the gin up there. 
not hearing anything anymore. Hello. Why is this still up? Who even put this down? Hello. I barely saw him try to pull that move off. And since they pulled him off, I can put him on. Still get the hook. Let's send everybody into crazy town. That's all three. Very nice. We want... Well, we want somebody at this point. Oh, there, oh, there he is. Is Bill following us? What is Bill doing? Not Bill. Ace. Getting stuck on things. Let's go after Bill. Which way are you gonna go? Nowhere? Okay. Gonna drop back down? There's a drop down right here, too. Oh, he got me. Very nice. Yeah, you got me. Very nice. You gotta have fun with these guys. You can't be all upset. Still up there, not doing anything. That's what we like. We like our folks not doing anything. All the doors are open. This is weird. They're healing somewhere. <laughs> so that's just him. Somebody's over here touching my gins. Billy's still in crazy town. Trying to get my attention. We don't care about him. Not right now. Not on that one. They're on this one. Now you want to play Ace? Oh, he ran off right on time. Somebody's over here. Oh, it's you. Interesting route. Let's see which way he goes. Right there in front of me. Don't know what the point of that was. Ah, almost. Let's go ahead and leave him alone. Still regressing. Nothing over here. Where did Ace run and hide? <laughs> there they are. You probably hop in to a locker. I'm not sure. What the hell's going on right now? <laughs> well, he was working on a gen, so let's go ahead and put him back in the basement. I do need my basement hooks. We gotta remember why we're here, folks. Somebody can clap my cheeks with this pallet. Nobody? Ace is giving up? Alright, Ace. Oh, he's dead. Did not know that. I could have. I could have got uh, three hooks out of him. They are not focusing on gens at all. Because they got that first gen done super fast. One over here. Two over here. Got everybody in crazy town. Still got the hit. Very nice. I landed right on her head. Let's see where she goes. What she does with this. She doesn't have much. Still going around town. Alright. Please go to basement. That would be great. Continue to basement, please. I'm getting closer. There we go. Very nice. So I do get three basement hooks at least out of this game. 
Let's see if somebody runs up and claps my cheeks. Both of them are injured, so I should hear them coming. No cheek clapping. Very nice. Let's go ahead and get Claudette up on this hook. And the third basement hook. Somebody's already on their way. Who is injured? It is what I like. Let's see if we can suss him out. There you are. And he's over there. It's the bill. Very nice. Let's see if we can get Bill in basement. Can we make it? Don't have boil over, so dropping shouldn't be a penalty. It's gonna be a stretch. And we made it. Very nice. Four hooks in basement. This is what we need for our challenge. I'm not usually a basement dweller, but I do need this for my challenge. If I can knock out all six in a single game, that would be phantasmic. Let's give this a kick. He was here. So it looks like he did leave potentially either there was a hatch offering. There was a hatch offering, um, along with three beamers and a lunchbox. My guess is he would be near a door, waiting for me to close hatch. And... <laughs> Sorry, buddy. I need my basement hooks. Well, not if you're in a fight. There we go. Appreciate it. I'm sorry, my friend. I just need my basement hooks. Don't blame me. Blame the challenge. I would have given you a hatch. No. I need my basement hooks. I'm sorry, my friend. Uh, on second thought. I only need two hooks in basement. I might be able to get this in one game. So we'll just play one more game and then I'll get my basement hooks. Because I don't think, even though they died, it doesn't count. If they die in a basement hook, like you don't get three automatic hooks, you actually have to put them on the hook. So even if I hook them, I would only get one. So what's the point? Oh, and I got Gatekeeper. I could have put it on that other challenge that's super redonkulous. Because they were focusing on probably running me and blinding me that they didn't focus on gens, because they got that first gen done very fast. They uh, also probably spawned in together in threes. In acing, it was a doctor, I guess, gave up immediately, which is very strange. And then he ended up doing more than the bill. Yeah, they wanted the blinds. They wanted the blinds. These guys were in cahoots with each other. All yellow or all amber, yeah. I don't know what's going on with Bill, though. I don't know if he's new or if, uh, what is that? Slippery Meat, rear perk, and left behind is a Bill perk. So, yeah, I don't know if he's new or if he just didn't put points into his, uh, Bill. So, Ace, Botany Knowledge, Prove Thyself, Self-Care, No One Left Behind, Deliverance, Resilience, Self-Care, Situational Awareness, Lightweight, Spine Chill, Self-Aware, and Resilience. A little bit of synergy in the builds. Nothing too bad. Um, they attempted to bully. They only got one blind. And that was it. I don't even think Ace ever even got to use his uh, aid kit. I think it was there left where I first hit him. So, pretty easy game. Uh, didn't go very hard. They didn't play very hard, I guess me being doctor and maybe us going to Crotus just put a kink in their plans and then I had Franklin's which really put a kink in their plan so that's what happens sometimes Swifts just give up so let's go on to the next game see what happens
Right. You know, usually with Swifts like that, with uh, three beamers and an aid kit, uh, I was expecting somebody to be waiting around the corner with a flashlight or something like that. It's pretty amazing that that didn't happen. Um, uh, can I get this with Huntress? Let's try Hag. I don't know, I'm getting... Uh, first game was a Swift, so I don't know how this is going to go. But if I can get somebody in the basement, usually that's when all the cards start to fall. It's just getting there is usually the hard part. Um, usually with a Swift uh, who didn't do any gems, I, they would be, you know, working in pairs, somebody waiting behind a tree with the flashlight to get the save, um, get the flashlight save. That did not happen at all. So, I, I guess their plans fell apart. It was very weird, that, that situation. Because they weren't doing gems. So... Um, these guys are also coming with some heat, uh, but we don't want to put on Frankies. We don't need Frankies. Let's try something else. Uh, I don't even know what I want to try. Let's try Starstruck. Actually, I kind of don't want Starstruck for uh, my hag. She's so slow. That was actually a bad switch. Oh dear. We're at somebody's uh, estate, somebody's home, so we must respect the thine home. We're just going to start throwing down. Really? And there she is. Communing with a white glyph. Too bad you're not going to... White glyphs are the absolute worst. I would not have grabbed that early in the game, because you have to... Make it without running, vaulting. Or getting hit. He didn't throw it. She is running fastest. Frugity fru. Oh, she did vault. all over this place. Let's go ahead and toss down some... Whoa, got this thing pumping, baby. Thank you for slowing that. Got my chat pallet right off the bat. Can we catch up to the Claudette? We can. Which way she go? Of course I'm facing the wrong direction. Somebody went in there. Somebody's over there. It's probably the Jake. Oh, it's somebody. 
She's behind me. Hello. Around the rock. How is she this fast? Does she have made for this? But this is ridiculous. Like, she's faster than my hag. Look how fast she is. She, oh, she didn't go for the wall. I am now on blood. Look how bad she is. How is this possible? I have heard of cheaters subtly cheating. But this is... I don't know if this is made for this or what. But apparently she has something going on with her. So the Maria has uh, super stealth. They already got this one done somehow. So we need to finish throwing these down. And there's a TTV here. I wonder if he's familiar with the super stealth that she has. Michaela, let's see what she does. Cutting through. Nice. That was, I don't know why I did that actually. Which way are we going? I am hitting a wall. There we go. Got the hit. Very nice. I'm getting gin rushed. Well, not really. There she is communing with the white one again. And then, look, look at her, look at her. Look how bad she is. So because of that, I lost track of the Michaela. Um, such is life. I don't even know where the basement is. But that Maria is ridiculously fast. I have no words for this. She's got this one pumping pretty quick. So I'm gonna have to get her off guard. But I wish I would stop finding her. I have things to do. So, yeah, she, she knows. And I, okay, so the TTV also knows. So these guys know how fast she is. Let's see how fast he is. Oh, that rock got... Knocking the ball. There she is. Switch to her. Switch back to him. Got him. So he's not, he doesn't have super speed. Which is fine. So his friend does. Not in the locker. There he is. Giving up, uh... Pallets. Don't know if that's wise. Maria's probably touching this one. But I don't have words for how fast she's able to move. It's pretty ludicrous. So... Uh, I'm gonna leave these two to it. And just get gin rush this game. Move on to the other... What are you, what's going on over here? Thank you for giving up another pallet. How, what? Oh, come. I got controller there. I don't have a reverse button. I can't turn around immediately. And I have no idea where the basement is. So he did heal himself fully. He does want to be chased. I still don't know where basement is. What's over here? Oh, it's him. Oh, that was a slow vault. She is so slow. I don't have time to play. Of course. Yeah, I'm getting green rush. Look at this. She, and that's Maria over there, probably. That was... I don't even miss... Press. Alright, so we have zero hooks. We're gonna see what happens with him. If we got lucky... And basement is like 
yeah. and we got lucky. Yeah. So I get. Yeah. So maybe it was a bad idea to yeah. let the other no! David go because I would be done with this. Come on. Can I, can, there we go. So we might be able to get our two hooks out of this. To salvage this game. Oh, he's killing himself. He's killing himself on hook. Well, that's here. She's healthy, though. Punch for it. Got her. Thank God. Don't think I'm going to be able to make it to basement with her, though, because it's on the other side. It's down there. This is going to be a close call, but we do need our basement hooks. Yep. Yeah. That was... I wasn't even close, bro. I don't even know which way she went. Wow, she is gone. Oh, but she left. Shaq is gone. We'll just hit the Michaela to get her out of the way. Let's see if anybody does anything stupid. There, she did something stupid. And all three of them are gone. So this was a four-man swift. I just needed that basement hook to finish out this challenge. But that's what happens when you have uh, going up against swifts. It was bad for me to put on Starstruck. That's on me. Um, but something's up with that Maria. So let's see what's going on with that. Very curious to see how. So she did have made for this. Now made for this gives you an extra three percent, but a hundred and three percent to still outrun me. So let's see what else she had to pick up her uh, speed. Self-aware, you walk twenty percent faster. That's fine. Um, and we're gonna live forever. Killing speed is increased. Okay, nothing improves your run speed. Expect, excuse me, except for made for this. So how was she running faster? I mean, it was Hag, so everything does come in their favor to have made for this. Hag is one of the slowest killers, if not the slowest killer. But that was pretty redonkulous, so that felt like more than 103%. Um, again, I have heard of cheats where subtle cheaters will move at 105%. Um, she didn't have any add-ons or anything to explain how fast she was able to go. I've never seen, I've caught plenty of people with Made For This, I've never seen Made For This make you faster than the killer on just Made For This. Something else is, uh, usually helps with that. There are other perks that you can put on and uh, other things you can do to become faster than 103%, I think. I know for killer there's a lot that you can do to move uh, much, much faster. But for survivors, that was very weird. That was very weird. In, in, in an injured state, you run at 103%. But even an extra 3%, you don't outrun the hag. Especially uh, with uh, Bloodthirst. Bloodthirst kicked in, and I still couldn't catch up with her. I don't know. Maybe I'm just uh, seeing things. You never know. So we have Approve Thyself, uh, Deja Vu, Unbreakable, and Kindred. So... With Deja Vu, you have 6% repair speed, and you toss in Prove Thyself. And if you're in with a Swift, then you can uh, triple team a Gen pretty easily and just blow through them because you're at 16%, uh, especially if uh, you toss in somebody with Resilience. Uh, it doesn't look like anybody had Resilience, but if you toss in Resilience along with Prove Thyself and Deja Vu, that Gen is going to be done in uh, like 20 seconds. Um, nobody came in with the toolbox. You toss in a toolbox with all of that, it's going to be done even faster. You want to gen rush somebody, do that. Especially if you have a four-man swift. Look at this. 20, 22, 13. I'm a three. So this person got these guys in at my, uh, my grade. 
Why am I going up against... I've gone up, up, up against P100s. Not with a hag. Actually, I have gone up against P100s with a hag. When I first started playing this game in, like, December, the game was horrible. Like, people were terrible to me. Um, these guys, I wouldn't even qualify them as a bully squad, some of the guys that I've gone up against in the past. I haven't seen those squads uh, as frequent as I used to. Maybe it's just a holiday thing, because I didn't start playing this game until December. But it was ludicrously bad back then. Um, maybe I've just gotten better. I'm not 100% sure. Um, but if you beat a bully squad, they will message you. That's what I've noticed back in the past. Again, I haven't noticed that as much. Maybe my name's out there a little bit more. I don't know. Uh, maybe I've just gotten better. But I haven't had as much salt as I did when I first started playing this game, which is a very odd coincidence. When I first started playing the game, I had mad salt. I don't even have TTV in my name, but people still looked me up on TTV, and I didn't have a microphone, so I couldn't talk. And people would just come and say, why aren't you talking? So that's what encouraged me to start speaking. I don't know if that's a good or a bad, but whatever. Um, but this was an interesting game. I have no words for how... And her name is Maria, so she's hiding her name. They're hiding their actual... Like, this person has their name, this person has their name, this TTV has his name. So this person is hiding or masking their name. Um, probably because they're up to no good. Something about that does not seem right. And I didn't... Ch I gave up on Chase. I didn't chase her enough to have enough to probably send to anyone to investigate. So, it's just one of those things. She lives to cheat to another day, I guess. And just like that, we have a P100. Speak of the devil. Did I speak this into existence? So this is probably another Swift, um, because I can't explain how a P100 would show up in my lobby. Um, the matchmaking uh, will not be getting a good review on Yelp. Um, so what do we want to do? What do they have? three things I'm not going to put on Franklin's. We do need a better uh, something or other here. Might We'll just put overcharge back on. We'll just do over... Oh, is that eruption? Hmm. Well, first I gotta get him in the dying state for eruption to take effect, so I should have probably done call a brine. Um, so we'll see how this goes. All I need is one hook in the basement, so I'm not too concerned about it. Uh, no hatch offerings, no map offerings. Which is rather unusual lately. A lot of, uh, Swifts have, have been coming in with map offerings for some reason. 
a lot of them. I haven't had one yet, and I I think I'm going up against three Swifts in a row, so this is only my third killer game of the night, and I've gone up against Swifts. Nothing but. Alright, so Mama's home. Not the greatest map, but not even for her. So, we just need to toss down some... Too close to a hook, I guess? I don't know. Put it back here. We actually should have put it up here. Put it right here. We just need to toss down some traps. get as many done as we can before the gens start going off like crazy. There are my crows doing the Lord's work. Somebody's heading towards that building. Probably that gen over there. We'll get them going up the stairs. Oh, it's close to a hook. Come on. And there it goes. Bit of murmur. They're walking away. And there they are. Mm, who is this? Ah! Meg? That's not a Meg. That's a Claire? There's the other one. She does not have balance landing. It's hard to see the scratch marks. Lunged for it. Hopefully she doesn't make it to pallet. She does not. She should not anyway. And we should be close to basement. So I might be able to make this. And I get my challenge out of the way immediately. This would be great. And we do. Very nice. Challenge complete. Mission done. We'll see how these guys are. Now that I got one of them in the basement. They did quickly complete a gen. They're probably up there. Oh, there's somebody right there. Let's see if we can flush them out. Oh. Where are you going? Back down. Oh, I actually fell for it. Good thing I have another trap right here. all over the place. Ah! Yeah, she wants to be chased. I don't know why. Probably to get me from the basement. I'm okay with that. She's running all the way to the corner. know why there's a hook like right here. How did I miss that? That is embarrassing. I can't believe I missed that. That was ludicrous. This is wasting all of my time. A little bit of wiggles. That's fine. They got me down to two gins. 
Look at these guys go, man. So they just did this main gen. Main building gen, that's fine. Not too worried about it. Somebody's behind me. Oh, they're above me. Sounds like the Mia. Still injured. Yeah, she's still injured. I can hear her. She's waiting to drop down, and... She doesn't know what to do. It's fine. I can't drop down right now. Wrong one. Of course I hit the wrong one. God damn it. Of all of them to hit, I hit the wrong one. There was a lot of tall uh, grass there. Didn't really have much of a choice. Nice. Let's just get this out of the way. Able to catch back up pretty quickly. Yeah, so even at 103% speed, I don't know how that Maria was able to move so quickly. Thank you. She stayed in front of me. Somebody's doing the uh, belly flop. She's right there. Somebody caused an explosion over here. Unfortunately, I don't have Deerstalker. What am I hearing? What was I hearing? What was... She wasn't even injured, so what noise... Oh, it was somebody's doing the belly flop. Who makes that noise? up there. Nia's trying to get the flashlight save. Is she gonna get it? No. But she will get these hands. This hook all the way in the corner. I might be able to. I don't even care if I get any kills right now. Um, not really worried about it. Challenge is complete, especially after that last game. I want to get this door trapped up. Nice and trapped up. Which gens completely regress. Alright, so somehow they got hurt. Switch out. Beamer, she is. And a Sabo, nice. Who am I going after? We're gonna continue after Michaela because I saw her. Somebody ran up there. There's no gin up there. It's already complete, so I'm not too worried about it. Alice in Wonderland's also here. Switch. No, we're gonna stay on the Michaela. Bloodthirst. Which way she's gonna go? Where'd she go? Ah, I can't... Now I can teleport. Jesus Christ. Teleport late as fuck. There she is. She bumped into a few things. Nia's 
was here to do something. Oh, I guess she's doing that. So where did I leave her? Where is she? She's already up. Somebody. She came back for it. Nice. Put this back off since I know where she is. Check on this gym. There she is. Not going in. Upstairs, nice. Got that. Oh, blast mine, nice. Wait that out. Traps down. She wants to be chased. Got rid of that pallet. Oh, she went downstairs. She did not look in front of her. Nia again. FOV for uh, consolers is pain in the ass. Don't know what that was about. I guess she thought I turned around. There's a hook. You know what? We'll just put her in. Can we make it to basement? That'd be great if we can make it to basement with her. I don't know if we're gonna make it. I don't really care. I'm down to one gen. She might get out. She does get out. And all of my traps are gone. They got these go they got these things going, buddy. Come on. Another blast mine. Is it maybe it's both of them? Kate and the cleric? It's okay. It is hilarious. Back down. They're working on this one too. She should be back on that one if she's smart. This one's not a lot. Nia again. Oh my gosh. This pallet has not been used. What are you up to? that about? That was a bad decision. Ah! Trying some shenanigans? Uh, uh, is there a doorway out of here? How do I get out of here? Uh, this is the way out. Uh, Got a hook right here. Claire's uh, uh, been healed. They're over there. Oh, she's dead. Claire's dead.
How did I? I am so fed up with this Nia, man. How did I miss this Nia? She has made for this. I shouldn't have swung for that. Reflex. Bad reflex. That was really stupid. I was right on her. Ugh. Terrible pathing. So we need to get back over here. There's Claire. Messing with my door trap. She's heading for another trap. Got her trying to go around. Eruption hit there. Nice. Nia should not be able to get the blind here. Can I get a hook somewhere? All I have is basement. And I'm probably not going to make it with her either. Nia is around. I'm probably not going to make it. Oh my gosh. So surprised. Oh, she's dead. Somehow came out with a tie for this. And both of them are here. Both of them are healthy, so I'm not too concerned. My hit and get my chase points. Thank you. And you may leave now. So somehow finished my challenge and got a tie? Don't know how that happened. Because I played like hot garbage. Um the Nia it was a P one hundred. And she did have made for this. But you see the difference? I was able to catch up to the Nia. So did the Claire, and I was able to catch up with the Claire. So explain the Maria. And I think that TTB, it might count against them if somebody watches some of their clips and that TTB is, you know, playing games with that friend and that friend is repeatedly showing that they're running at 105% or, or, or more than 103%. I was, I caught up to the Claire and I caught up to the Nia. They got hooks in them. Claire even died and they had made for this. I have no explanation for how that Maria was able to outrun me. And it's the same hag. Same hag. Um, so I might clip both of these trials. Because the character was made for this back to back. And one was much faster than 103%. Much, much faster. So the Nia did have dead heart. I just didn't see the animation for it. Which is odd. Like, there was no animation. Um, and I think my camera was on her. So I should have at least saw her elbow go forward or something. Um, so Blast Mine for the Kate and the Claire. Also have Blast Mine. So yeah, so the Kate and the Claire did have Blast Mine. Um, Exponential. I don't recall hearing a boom. Buckle Up and Saboteur. Uh, Prove Thyself. Built to Last. Blast Mine and Made for This. Made for This, Saboteur. Dead Hard, Adrenaline for the Nia, Bond, Plot Twist, so it wasn't Michaela who belly flopped and at some point in the game during the start, uh, Tenacity, and Sprint Verse. Uh, so I guess, does Tenacity and Plot Twist work well together? Like, does it move faster? I don't know. It's, might be interesting to look into. But, uh, yeah, this P100 Nia, I don't know... How can you feel good about yourself? Like... When you're a P100, you've invested how many hundreds of, not even hundreds, but thousands of hours into a video game to get a character up to P100, and you're playing with a P3. I mean, I, I don't know how she feels good about herself. Like, how is that a dunk? And then on top of that, you're swiffing, you're swiffering with your buddies against a P3, and you're a P100, a P39, a P11. And your little P3 buddy got you in my lobby, probably. I just don't understand the ego here. Like, why even do this? When you're up against a P3, how, and like, if I'm Egg, I, how am I looking at that P100 and giggling with, along with him? Yeah, we really got that P3. 
person who spent how many thousands of hours into this game to get their character to P100 and were swiffing against on top of that. But, you know, teach their own. Um, this does happen a lot. It's been worse for me when I was a P nothing and I was getting P100s. And I, let me tell you, nothing feels better than getting two or three P100s or uh, in a four man swift in your lobby as a trapper. A P nothing trapper and killing all four of them some bitches. Now that's a good game. But uh, I made a lot of mistakes. Somehow still came out with a, a, a halfer. But more importantly, we finish our challenge. Moving on. So I have switched to Survivor, and as anticipated, I am with a, what's very likely, very, very likely, to be a three-man swift. And this killer probably just switched out some perks in response to these, what they now see. That's three lunchboxes and a beamer. That's what they're going up against. A frightful plan. That's from, like, November of last year, I think. 
obviously the aura of the hooks. So the killer wants to know where the basement is, so they might be doing their six basement hook challenge. You never know. But uh, I would probably want to know where the basement is if I saw what is very likely a swift coming at me and he might be lumping me in because I do have a lunchbox along with the other two, or excuse me, other three. So this is going to be a very interesting game. Somebody's bringing in a frightful plan to the party. Not falling for it. I think I was started next to the killer. So I'm not gonna hop on a gen too quickly here. Scope out, see if I can see any totems. It's like a gen there and a gen here. the chin that's further in. And he's on the Victoria, so that's okay. I no longer have my uh, detective hunch. Switched out for proof myself. Because our challenge is Lightbringer. somebody else. Top one. Yes. Get me some of that prove thyself magic. We need to... I need to knock out as many gens as I can to be Lightbringer. So I just need Victoria to run this killer for at least three gens. That'd be great. We don't want to do the gen back there, because we're three gen ourselves. We don't want to do that. We want to move further into the map. Do the more riskier ones while we have the most people alive. What are you doing? See something? He's right there. And I'm gonna give zero fucks. No boon in there. <coughs> Shit, and the killer's like right on us. And I'm near basement! They stood there, and then he runs the killer right over top of me, instead of the other way around. Then, the killer does something incredible, instead of using the- oh, he had the other door, uh, with the bear trap, so he had to use the one with the pallet, and nobody gets the pallet safe after the failed light? And now he's just staying on top of me. This one's staying, okay. The, 
Is that Nia? Uh, so the Karina's back on a gen. These two are dancing around in one area. Okay, so now the killer's going after her. Now he's coming back. I'm gonna go to stage two. Yep. Because it's two seconds too late. Oh my gosh. Find the window. Everything was so dark. And now they're not gonna get the pallet save again for a second time in a row. And I'm on death hook. Now he's just gonna do this. What was the point? doing and now he's facing you and you still don't get the blind you are a fucking failure my guy this guy is so bad you want to get a flashlight saved so bad that you're so bad at the game I just need to get away from this one because if he picks me up again uh, it, it, she runs off He's in the basin. <laughs> Why did you even stop? What are you doing? <laughs> These guys are so bad. These guys are just so bad. She runs away as soon as he gets hooked. He's all the way in the basement. And she runs away again. <laughs> Can you get this done? No. opportunities and I, I I mean I didn't play well myself um, trying to get past the trapper pushed me to the inside hit the bear trap um, bear trap was also on the other side he hit me again unfortunately screen went so dark I couldn't see the window and there was a bear trap in the other door so I couldn't see anything so I couldn't see which side the uh, window was on so these guys came sweating, look at this, in a green med kit, it was not even a ranger's med kit, but emergency med kit, and they played so bad. Like, the, what's her name? Serena, so I call her Karina. Serena was like all over the place, and all they had to do was take a hit. That's all she had to do was take a hit. You are devotion three, five, and four, and you're this terrible? Terrible flashlight saves. You got hit for no reason. So let's see. He made for this. So he wanted to run, I guess, his extra 3%. Do And then do his... Okay, so this is where you are so fixated on doing something that it causes you to make some really stupid decisions. Like, these guys made some really, really bad decisions because he wanted to get a flashlight save so bad that he made some really bad decisions. He wanted to use his bait for this so bad that he got hit for no reason. He wants to use plot twists. So they just rushed into just making really bad decisions and I paid the ultimate price for it. He failed all, so many times to get a flashlight save. Zarina ran away for no reason, then came back, wasted so much time either hop on a gin or don't. A lot of these guys were indecisive, but for a swift, these guys were pretty terrible. And now... Well, looks like the Nia's. Yeah, these guys were pretty bad. And how many gens were done? Oh, they got all four done. I have no idea what's going on. All of a sudden, they're playing better. 
Is it because they take the game seriously now? He's running the killer. You couldn't do that. What was the point? Just go to the other. Uh, just. Uh -oh. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? You're letting her die on hook. You could have undone the trap. And now he's down. I don't... I have no words for how I'm baffled I am by these guys. Why did you let her die on hook? I, I mean, these, these, I am assuming these guys are in a swift. I think this is a three-man swift, and I was a Randy. And I guess the person on hook just said, let me go. But she's leaving the Vittorio, probably wasting his time, the killer's time, because he has plot twists. So I don't know if you can use plot twist when it was... I think it was a killer that caused you to go down. Oh, looks like he can. And he's up. Fully healthy. So I guess it wasn't the killer that caused him to go down. He belly flopped. Going to the all-knowing shack of pain. Killer right behind him. But he's gonna make it out because he's fully healthy. Um... That's unnecessary. He's gonna use up all his beamer. Um, the Nia was more than a hundred percent savable, even if he had bear traps at both doors and the window. Just why did why didn't you just undo the trap? You could just set the trap off and run over it. I mean, maybe he had two or three traps down in the basement, too? Because I think I saw another one. But, big deal. Run over it. Uh, with the person who is being let off the hook, just walk around it. Then they can run over it. Doesn't matter. I have no words for this game. He played like shit at the start. Did he finally just calm down and just be like, oh shit, he tunneled somebody out. And it wasn't even an intentional tunnel. He didn't even want to tunnel me out, but he did pick me up and put me on hook. So that was on him, knowing that I was left on hook to go to second stage. So I was only hooked twice, which really sucks when you're, uh, you're the Randy and the three-man Swift. That really sucks when you're left to go to stage two uh, on your first hook, especially at the start of the game. Um, and he did camp, so yeah, I don't have any good words to say for that killer, and I have even less words to say for these, uh, these survivors. That was just a wacky game. That was such a wacky game. Like, I, it is unfortunate. It was a series of unfortunate events. Like, those damn bear traps. And my screen going so dark because he did hit me right off hook. So I couldn't see where the window was. And he was blocking both exits. So that was just an unfortunate game. And I was the one person that got tunneled out. Which is a lot of times how these games you go. The killer will tunnel somebody. Because it just makes the game easier. It's not necessarily against the rules. It's an option that killers have, and they unfortunately take it. It just sucks to be the person tunneled out. And it is a sucky tactic. It is a shitty tactic, especially when they do it uh, at the very start of the game. But I'm still curious how they got all those gins done that quickly. Somebody must have picked up a toolbox, maybe. I didn't check their perks. I don't know if somebody had scavenger box with uh, some add-ons. Uh, I did have proof thyself, and I only did the one gin with this with Zarina. But I'm so confused. Why didn't she? 
attempt to cause a trap. Why didn't she attempt to disarm the bear trap and get the Nia out of the basement? She had time. She could have made it. Even if she had to disarm two traps, I still think she could have made it. What a wacky game. So sometimes when uh, Swift friends say, leave me, don't come and get me, a lot of people don't listen. She definitely listened. And just let her friend die on hook. That was just very odd, because the killer was definitely near Victoria. She had the opportunity. That was just weird. Of course she touches the gem. <laughs> Touch the gin, and I'm the one being chased. starting off lovely. So these two touch the gin, and I'm the one that gets chased. And everybody's staying on gin. Here comes the Meg. Kate is now heading... 
why is it that when the killer comes after you, then you start running towards the hook? It's like... It's, she went down anyway. I will never understand this logic. Why is it that you stay on your gen until the killer starts coming after you? Then when the killer's on your tail, you run to the person who's on the hook to unhook them with the killer behind you. I will never understand why they do this. And she still went down when I tried to take the hit for her. Today is just not my day. Both of them got hooked. So he has uh, nowhere to hide, I think. Now he's on the Leon. I have broken status. That took up uh, every bit. There, now he's... didn't see me. And he's able to kind of camp both of them. Okay, are you killing yourself? What are you doing? And now he's down. He's probably gonna pick up the Leon. She's gone to stage two. I don't know which way he went. Totem there. She's running straight to him. She doesn't want to play anymore. literally ran straight to him. She's dead on hook. He's probably confused as fuck. either. I 
feels like it is. Buddy, uh, he's gonna find you. You're not in a locker. <laughs> You're not near a loud gin. I don't know what the goal was up there. Ugh, I'm getting negatives. I just lost two pips. And I'm the highest scoring person in this game. That is problematic. This, I lost a pip and I'm the highest scoring person in this game. These guys just came to fuck around. Look at this. Two boil over. Spine chill. Sprint burst. And you, both of them gave up. Leon sort of played the game. Both of them gave up. And he found a purple toolbox too. Nice. Oh, somebody shoot me a message. I wonder what the hell they want. Ah, it's the killer. Kill control I meant sloppy butcher. That was a mess. I message him, that was a mess. The Swift quit immediately. Uh, the Meg and the Kate quit. And they had boil over, so I don't even understand that. Pyramid Head even gave them a chance. But they still didn't want to play. They just quit. And when half your team's gone, and you were the first person hooked, there ain't much you can do after that. That was just a really unfortunate game. all two unfortunate games in a row. So with that, I'm just going to call it a night. Good night.